Meanwhile, a peaceful protest like the one in Dallas last night had been planned here in Omaha for today. This is to draw attention to the officer involved shooting deaths in both Minnesota and Louisiana. It all began about an hour ago. That's where our Chase Moffitt uh, is covering the event. Here's more on what he gathered from today. One call at a time. Omaha is going to be inundated probably, so priority one and twos. Outside the Douglas County Sheriff's Office, the flag flies at half staff. We all know what happened last night. As always, just watch your officer safety. But inside, the thoughts of the police officers who were tragically shot and killed in Dallas Thursday night are still fresh on these deputies' minds. But they still have to get back to work. They do have community support helping them during tonight's shift. Not knowing what to expect in light of yesterday's events, we just hope that it doesn't deviously inspire someone else. And all throughout the Omaha area, police are back on the job. Here at 28th and Crown Point, investigators continue processing this scene. It's connected to the city's latest homicide. Then over in Council Bluffs earlier Friday morning, police were working a standoff with two suspects after reports of gunfire in the area. Those two suspects eventually taken into custody. The officers get ready every day. I mean, they put on their uniforms. They're ready to answer those 911 calls. In light of all of the tragedy that occurred yesterday and the heinous crimes that occurred, they still respond. And then over at the Croc Center in South Omaha, a special graduation underway for the Kids Omaha Police Academy. That's where we meet Captain Kathy Gonzalez, who believes events like this strengthen relationships between these officers and their community. They're here by choice. They want to be here interacting with our community, showing not only what they're doing, but also helping them build those great relationships. These parents proud their daughter completed the program, and they couldn't agree more with the Omaha police captain. We want her to be able to know that the police are here to protect us and to help us.